wrestling fans, this is Sterling Brewer at the City Auditorium in Birmingham, Alabama, watching a tag battle that has Dennis Hall teaming up with George Goulas going against Rocket Monroe and Randy Tyler. This is one fall of 30-minute time limit. The match has been going on for something less than 10 minutes now. The action has been hot and heavy. George Goulas in the ring right now with Rocket Monroe. It has been a fast exchange from both teams. Randy Tyler stretching over the ropes trying to tag, but Rocket Monroe is not in tag territory at the moment. A match the fans are enjoying very much. And we'll be dropping in on it from time to time to bring you filmed highlights of this match as it progresses. match progressing going on it's been going for 12 or 13 minutes now both teams still going strong at the moment Randy Tyler in the ring but he wants out George Goulas in there he's been straining to make a tag Randy Tyler is successful Rocket Monroe coming in kicks George Goulas in the head both teams going very strong working well together an interesting match and they seem very evenly matched there's been of course a great deal of, of rules violating being done by Rocket Monroe and Randy Tyler. Goulas makes a tag. Here comes Dennis Hall into the ring. Watch him go. Dennis Hall working on Randy Tyler and Rocket Monroe. Puts Tyler on the mat. Monroe on the ropes. George Goulas in the ring too. Wild action. Here they go together. Watch it. Randy Tyler and Rocket Monroe on the mat. George Goulas in the ring. Going up for the elbow smash on the back of the neck. We'll pick up the action again in a few moments. George Goulas using the elbow on Rocket Monroe. He's got him back in the corner. He's been pounding away at the head. It climbed the ropes and was pounding at him. Hurls him into the turnbuckles in the neutral corner of the ring. Outside the ring, Rocket Monroe's head bleeding, cut open by one of those blows or the boot from Dennis Hall. I believe it was from those blows from George Goulas. However, he's bleeding profusely, staggering around, having difficulty seeing blood streaming down from his forehead into his eyes, down his nose. On the ropes he goes and comes off as George Goulas plants a big one in the midsection. Goulas on him for one, two. Randy Tyler came in to interfere. Dennis Hall prevented it. Rocket Monroe came out from under, but Goulas has got him. Goulas had him in the Boston Crab. Randy Tyler used some weapon, wrapped it around his fist, hit Goulas in the back of the head. Rocket Monroe covered him for the count of one, two, three. Goulas has not moved yet. He's down and out. Rocket Monroe and Randy Tyler getting their heads lifted in victory. Randy Tyler used some object on George Goulas. Knocked him senseless and Rocket Monroe covered him. Goulas had the Boston Crab on Rocket Monroe. Monroe bleeding profusely being helped from the ring by his partner Randy Tyler, but in the ring, George Goulas has not moved yet. Dennis Hall complaining to the referee about some weapon being used. Trying to lift Goulas now, trying to drag him to the, to the apron. George Goulas out cold. He had the Boston Crab on Rocket Monroe, had him down, had him down for the count. But Randy Tyler came in and interfered. He used some weapon on the head of George Goulas. He has not moved yet under his own power. Dennis Hall and Jerry Vincent helping him from the ring, but he seems totally helpless at the moment. Here comes help from the dressing room. Two of the referees coming. They're bodily carrying him from the ring. Dennis Hall coming by. Dennis, what was it? He Jordan, I don't know. He hit him with something. I've got to get back with him. He hit him with something in the head. Okay, Dennis Hall going with George Goulas to the dressing room. The decision right now stands as Rocket Monroe and Randy Tyler are winning the match. Hey, that's 